Welcome back to Honor Football. Today's review is going to be on the new Grip Boost football towel that I unboxed a couple weeks ago. I took this towel with me to Costa Rica with Team USA when we played in our exhibition game. Got a chance to use it in the game and I definitely liked what I saw. So I'm going to give you guys the detailed performance review, which is what you came here for, and tell you all about this towel, how it differs from some towels I used in the past, and why you might want to take a look at this as well. So the main towel I'm going to be comparing it to today is a Nike towel. You guys know that I'm a Nike fan. I'm wearing Nike stuff right now, uh, but I've had three of these towels. I got it in white, I got it in pink, and I got it in black. But I saw this new Grip Boost towel, and what I talked about in the unboxing that I really liked about it was that it was long, it was slender, and it talked about the absorption properties uh, different from some of the other towels that you might find. So first, let's talk about how the towel works and the performance of the towel. It is a thin microfiber material, uh, which is good. It's actually much thinner than anything that you're gonna find from some of the other brands. Uh, this towel, you know, more spreads out. Uh, so when it is folded, it is gonna be thicker. So just looking at that alone, you know, this is gonna be a thin, lightweight piece. Uh, the other good thing about this towel is that cleaning a visor leaves no streaks. I've never had a towel yet that I could use to clean a visor. I've always had to go into my bag, find my you know, Oakley microfiber towel to wipe down my visor. This is perfect on the field, in the rain, you know, hitting dirt. I can just take this towel um, and I can wipe my visor and there's no streaks. So that's another great thing about it. The other thing is just the style. I'm going to show you guys in a little bit what it looks like when I hook it into my pants. Um, but it just looks cooler because this is what people are wearing nowadays. You know, you, they take the towels, they cut the long thin strip. So of course you can do that with a towel or you can use this which is gonna have better absorption properties than any towel that you get at like Bed Bath Beyond or Target or something like that. So those are pretty much the benefits. Um, of course the cost is another benefit just because it is more inexpensive than a Nike towel. I think Nike towels are about 20 bucks. Maybe you can find them for 15. This is gonna be 10 bucks from Grip Boost and they might even give you a deal if you're getting some other things like the Grip Boost glove gel that I reviewed a couple weeks ago as well. So those are like the great things about this towel that I love. There's a couple of things I wish they would improve or just some watch outs for you guys if you're thinking about ordering this towel. The first thing is it only comes with a belt hook. It doesn't come with a belt loop. So if you have football pants, um, and I'll show you mine in a little bit, that do not have a belt, you guys know I love my Adidas Tech Fits. They have no belt, they only have a drawstring. How are you going to wear this towel? There's no belt loop to put it through. Um, also, if you have uh, you know, some of the more modern pants where the belt loop is actually inside of the pants, it's also gonna be a little bit harder to wear or it's gonna make the towel super short, but it is possible to wear. Um, so what I did is I actually put some Velcro on it. You don't need to put Velcro on it at all. If you have a pants that you, know, you can't wear, use the belt loop, what you're gonna do is you're just gonna tuck it in there, um, tie your pants tight, and you know, hope that doesn't fall out, similar to the same way that I wear my Nike pants. Putting a strip of Velcro, you know, gluing it on there, just one side of it, is actually gonna help it stick to the inside of your pants, which is what I did. What I also wish about this towel is that I wish it was a little bit longer. So it already is longer. It already is longer than a Nike towel. So here's the two towels, you know, side by side. The belt loops are matched up, and you can see that this is considerably longer. Um, but when you fold it, you know, to tuck in, it is just going to be slightly longer. So I wish the towel was a little bit longer. Um, also, when you're cleaning your gloves, because the towel doesn't fan out, it takes a little getting used to to get enough you know, space on your towel to kind of dry your gloves or wipe your visor. But those, that's a small problem that I didn't mind overcoming to have, uh, you know, a nice looking towel like this. I like the Grip Boost logo on here. You know, it looks high quality. It's embroidered right in. Um, so, you know, that's gonna last throughout the, the life of the towel. And it's pretty easy to clean. You know, I played in the grass with this. It did have grass stains on it, so obviously I used the technique that I always do uh, to get out grass stains, which I made another video for, so you can check that out. Uh, but you know, you don't have to worry about uh, this towel getting dirty. Uh, now, I do wish that it came in different colors. Uh, maybe they're just starting with white, uh, but I would like a black version. You know, when we go uh, all black with the Mustangs, I would like to have a black Grip Boost towel, so maybe we'll see something like that in the future. Um, so now before I finish the review, let me show you what it looks like when it's tucked into my pants. Just lowered my camera, I'm gonna turn around so you guys can look at how the towel hangs, how long it is, and how it looks, and how it's that new style that you've been seeing in college football. 
So you can see from this angle how long the towel is and how it hangs from my pants. Like I said, it's tucked in so it's even a little bit shorter than it would be. But I want to show you guys, you know, if I'm trying to clean my gloves uh, like this, you can see how I have, you know, limited space for my gloves. Uh, but still, it makes it possible for me to wipe all the moisture off my gloves. Also, you know, when I take my helmet, since it's a little bit longer, I do have less surface area to wipe, you know, a visor. Um, so, I mean, that's pretty much, you know, my review. The last thing is, I do have one more Grip Boost towel that I'm giving away. The details are in the description of this video. Um, I'm giving one Grip Boost towel away so that you guys can have it for your football season. Now, if you want to enter it in, Look down below in the video description. Make sure you follow all the instructions. There's only a couple of them. And I'll announce the winner in a week and mail this to you and you'll have it shortly. So if you like my videos, remember to give me a thumbs up, share, subscribe, and I'll see you next time.